I have come to Bosnia, town of Kozarac, to tell you a very interesting sporting story. This town was a place of vicious ethnic cleansing in the early 90s. What exactly happened back then was well documented in the books of Roy Gutmann, Witness to Genocide from 1993, and of Peter Maas, Love Thy Neighbor from 1996. The results were terrible. Hundreds upon hundreds of local citizens were imprisoned, raped, killed, and in worse cases, the whole families were massacred in front of each other. One of the most famous names amongst all the victims was that of bodybuilding champion Fikret Hodžić. In order to find out who Fikert really was, I have come to visit his wife, Suada. Suada, and what was his specific formula for success? Fikert was a specific for the fact that everything he achieved, he achieved with the right training, with the right food, without the steroids and without anabolic. The most he practiced was training outside, Dijambearable pain his grave, and ruins of a house where he used to practice and where a few other memorabilia are stored are the only things that remain 20 years since his murder. The importance of Fikret's legacy is best summarized by a huge number of his friends, competitors, acquaintances, who all remember him by the fact he was a champion with a smile. His charisma, his presence, his friendly face and humanity were overwhelming. With the war and his death, the life of a middle-class Bosnian family, which lived off trade, sport and success, was shattered in 1992. I feel it would be great if you and I get together in order to rebuild this great life story. A project proposal on this subject is published online. I would therefore like to invite you to 